Hey guys, it's Armando and I just want to bring you some more tips to help you with your situation going on with the property. Uh, if anybody has been told by the bank or somebody you're working with is being handled or is being taken care of, I just want you guys to know the true facts, the hidden truth of what's really going on behind those statements because many people have gotten tricked by those words thousands that I've seen personally with my own eyes and I don't want that to happen to you again my family we didn't have the right people helping us and now we lost that property it's not in our family anymore and I don't want the same thing to happen to you guys or you guys get tricked this is from seeing thousands of thousands of cases if you really want to know how th if things are handled or not mm. just check if you're still on the foreclosure list usually if people are still contacting you every single day that'll give you a good sign because those people who are contacting you they are checking the foreclosure list every morning so they don't waste their time or their energy trying to call everybody who might not be on the list. So if you're still getting contacted, just know you still may be on the list and find out what's really going on. What you want to do is you want to call the bank. Say, is there an active notice of default on my property? They'll say yes or no, and that's how you know it's taken care of. Uh, what some of these people you're working with may do, what I've seen a lot, and be careful for this, is some of these people would tell homeowners, don't listen to other people, don't do this, don't do that. They'll put blinders on you. They won't show you what, about other options. So just be careful because this happens thousands of times. I've seen it happen just last week. And I talked to somebody and they didn't know about this option, that option, that option. Mm. So it's just crazy how some people do this. Again, as you know, there's a lot of people scamming people in this industry so that's why i want to bring you the truth so this doesn't happen to you and your family and as you go through your journey in this foreclosure game you'll see that everything that i said comes true or has already came true to you i guaranteed so let's move on what most people will try to do is they'll put you in what i call a time trap what they'll do is they'll delay they'll keep the problem going they'll tell you it's being handled but you're still on the foreclosure list They'll tell you, don't worry. They'll tell you, don't listen to others while they're delaying. And at the 11th hour, what they'll do is say, oh, nothing's working. So you have no choice but to sell the property or lose it. This happens to thousands of people every single day. So be very, very careful about that. You do not want to be that guy who has to sell on the 11th hour because you trusted the wrong person. So be very careful about that. Another quick way to know if it's being handled is if it's been over 30 days or not. If it's been over 30 days and you've been working with somebody, just know that what they're doing is not the best for you because in 30 days, they should have definitely, definitely had this whole situation taken care of. They should have had you off the list a long time ago. So anything over 30 days, just be very careful because the person um, could have other motives. So just be very, very careful. If that's the case, have a plan B because know that this person is dragging you out. Also know that you're the boss and this person doesn't control you or your situation or your paperwork. You can always move your paperwork to anybody at any time because you are the boss. This is your house and you need to figure out what's good for you. So if your gut is telling you the person you're working with is not doing the best job, find somebody else who you could trust. Give me a call. My number's below. I'll refer you to somebody who's in your neighborhood who's very trustworthy because I've seen them all. I know who the vultures are. 99% of the people do is they'll put you in this time trap. So if this is your day one of foreclosure, they'll get you as a client. They'll promise you they'll help you. They'll promise you the world. They'll pitch you a pipe dream. This happens so much, so many times. And what they end up doing is taking over 30 days, which delays the process. They don't come to a solution and all this time gets delayed. More time gets delayed. More time gets delayed. Mostly they'll do a modification for you and they'll tell you that they're still working with the bank. They're waiting for an answer. They need more paperwork. Send this in, send that in, which is a bad sign already. Uh, sometimes attorneys will contact you to sue the bank. Give them more time. They're waiting to hear back from the bank, which is BS. So as you go down, down the road, down the road, next thing you know, a week or two before your auction date, they tell you the bank's not going to work with you. There's, they tell you there's no other option. You have to sell the property. It's crazy how much this happens. At the 11th hour, they'll tell you that unfortunately you have to sell the property or else you're going to lose it and help you leave with dignity. The neighbors don't have to know and all this stuff. You'll get this. Believe me, if you haven't got this already, you will get this if somebody's messing with you and just delaying times. So these are all the hidden secrets. These are all the things to know. I want you and your family to be well prepared. And when people are talking to you, you can remember these facts and you will know if they're trying to play you 
or if they're real with you. So here's the facts. I've seen thousands and thousands of cases and this has been a big, big issue with the community because people b try to believe the person who they're working with or they try to believe the bank that it's being handled, that stuff is in process, but that stuff is in process just gets you further down the road till you get to here, unfortunately. And I don't want this happening to you guys. Hope this information helps. Please don't be like what happened to my family. And I really want to see the best for you. If you have any questions or you, this is happening to you and you need some more guidance, mention this video, give me a call and I'll give you a free five minute consultation. Again, give me a call. I'll give you a free five minute consultation. Just mention this video and I'll take care of you guys because I want to give you all this free information that I have in my head that I've known from seeing thousands and thousands of cases. So take care guys, take action and I wish you the best.